Uh, bali galing ako sa ano sa Marikina. Eh papunta ako doon papunta ako sa Bulacan. <laughs> medyo malayo pa. Eh wala akong helmet, eh medyo kulang pa po sa ano eh sa pambili. <laughs> Ingat po. Good morning everyone. As the Philippines turns into the new normal, a lot more people are turning to bicycles to get themselves to work. The problem is they're not wearing helmets and that's something that really worried me. So I reached out to people I've worked with recently and I was able to secure 30 bicycle helmets that we can give away today. Now 30 bicycle helmets in the grand scheme of things might not seem like much, but it's a start and it's a reminder. Plus this one does have a visor to protect you from the sun. I think going forward we'll transition to a slightly better one, but any helmet is better than no helmet. And these were given for free and we'll be giving them away today for free. So let's go. What area? I am from Marikina. Marikina? Yes. And where are you going? I'm going to work. Where's your work? Is it in supermarket? Here in Kubao. Kubao? Yes. Okay. You're not wearing a helmet before? You I can't sir. find one. I can sir. Before, walang helmet mo? Wala po. Okay. Bago lang po kasi ako nagbabike eh. Oh, okay. And there goes one rider now wearing a helmet. So that's the first of the day. And if you're curious, yes, we did do coordination with the local enforcement agency because we don't want to just flag people down and start doing some kind of operation without coordination first. Uh, Ma'am, where did you come from? Marikina City. Uh, Marikina also. Where are you going? Quiapo. Quiapo? How long would that take you? One hour. One hour yeah. by bicycle? Yeah. You don't have a helmet? No. Why? What happened? I didn't have money to buy. No money to buy? Okay, now you have. Thank you, ma'am. Thank Inga. you. Wala nga nang pambili ng ano? Kami? Salamat sir. There goes one more rider. So this lady has a face shield but no helmet. Let's see. Ma'am, where did you come from? Ah, Marikina po, Malanday. Where are you going? Ah, Mega Mall. Ah, wala kasi sir, pambili. Okay, how about now? Okay na? Okay na sir, marami salamat po. Okay, ingat po. Salamat. So the lady is also riding with her husband here, so we gave him one too. So uh, we're gonna run out of helmets, but it's a start. Another difficulty for bicycles is getting enough air and not overheating under the sun. So I went and bought some bottled water and we'll be giving these away also. Sorry, I'm a little bit out of breath because these are quite heavy to carry back. But we have around 30 bottles of water to give away also. Look, there's a lot of riders there, but uh, I suspect some of them are maybe just riding because they enjoy riding rather than specifically going to work. Sir. So far so good. Everyone has been happy to receive the bicycle helmet and they're putting them on immediately and riding away. The interesting story about these is they actually came from the same guys who donated the foot pedal alcohol dispenser. I was speaking to them about this idea I had about giving away water, giving away helmets, and then two days later he sends me a photo. Oh, I have 30 bicycle helmets for you to give away. <laughs> Another thing I want to think about giving away is fluorescent jackets or strips, reflective strips and bicycle lights, not just helmets, but this is a start and uh, I think helmet, well, let's hope it helps. It's not guaranteed to save your life, but it will help, hopefully. If you look over there, you see one of the military trucks being used for Libre ride, so a free ride for commuters. Aside from that, the trains are running and there are some buses, but they are limited because of social distancing. 
and because of certain routes being allowed and uh, there might be some challenges on the inner roads because there's no jeepneys but there are tricycles so there is public transport but it's quite limited at the moment and that's why a lot of people are turning to bicycles it will get better over time you see over there that's most likely a company shuttle for a wheelcon in fact it says on the end uh, employee service so a lot of companies have been advised to provide a shuttle for your employees to make it easier for them sa ano po sa pagbiyo ako galing wheelcon papasok ako dito pagbaw sir sa security bank at hindi pa ako nakabili ng sasano kilmit Galing kami sa Marikina. Pagkasok kami sa Trinoma. Wala kami helmet eh. Wala pang pambili. That's two more ladies riding away. Not everybody wants to be on camera today and we're respecting that. And sometimes we see people on the other side so we just run over and give them a helmet without putting them on camera. But uh, yeah, hopefully it helps. There's so many bicycles without a helmet and it's really scary to think what will happen to them. Galing po ako sa may uh, uh, isang barangay ng Kainta, baunti rin ng Marikina. Eh, wala po akong pambili ng helmet, tsaka yung bisikleta ko may kalumahan na rin. And there he goes, off to work, security guard, now with a helmet. And that is actually our last helmet to give away today. So, yep, thank you for watching and big, big, big thank you to the sponsors of the helmets today.